welcome or welcome back to my channel my name is ash and you are watching smoke shelves i am here i have just put together this footage from the vault i reorganized my shelves preliminary reorganized my shelves back in december i think that is when i had decided to take on that endeavor because i was home i brought home a bunch of books i had a lot of books accumulated over the few months while i was home i will link the book haul that discusses just all the books that i hauled in those four-ish months where I was gone, so feel free to watch that. And here I am just attempting to put them all on my shelves. I was already low in space. I have a bunch of books here too. I attempted to reorganize some stuff. I had some ideas. I reverted a few things back to the way I used to do it. Namely, I moved my Atla comics back to my desk shelves, which I used to keep them that way when I had no like actual bookcase. But other than that, I was just trying to figure out some way to organize my stuff. You'll see I have a few different ways of organizing. You might not like the way I organize, but I like the way I organize. Uh, it worked for me. I don't mind that series are split up. I really just like the colors. I like having that rainbow colors. I'm a height person. I really appreciate having height together. And yeah, that's pretty much the way I organize. You'll see I have my rainbow shelves and then my genre shelves that are by height. On the bottom of my main bookcase, I have my favorite shelf which is incomplete at this point. I have too many favorites for it to go. And then I have a third shelf, so that's all my black books that are above my dresser. And I have a fourth shelf that I don't show. It is a shelf that I keep a lot of my childhood favorites or books that I received many years ago before I started reading the way I avidly do now. So I have my Alice in Wonderland, Barnes edition. I have my El Enchanted copy up there. I actually have the Mortal Instruments, that series is over there as well. So a lot of those types of books, books that I read it a long time ago or I haven't really picked up and haven't really been meaning to pick up, but a lot of that type of stuff. So I am going to give you an ASMR-esque light music type situation in real-ish time. It's a little bit sped up, but for the most part, pretty close to actually the speed I was organizing in. It took me maybe half an hour maximum to do it because I had ideas of where I wanted things to go and some of it I was just putting back. Yeah, I've been rambling on. I really do hope you enjoy this video and I might pop in with comments as I'm going. Like the fact that you can hear my dog barking in one of the clips. No, he's not barking. He's playing with his toy. But yeah, that's that's the video. Let's go on to the organization.
Okay, I really do hope you enjoyed the organization that I did. Uh, as you can see, it wasn't a perfect organization. I moved around things a lot. I sat there contemplating a lot. I actually ended up changing my top shelf above my main bookcase to have some other, I set it up somehow differently. I set it up some other way after I finished the video like a few days later. I think I got more books in, more special editions, and I decided to <laughs> mess with it even more. So that's not how it was at the end of the video. I don't have any videos or photos of that, but I plan on at some point when I move back home doing a full bookshelf 
tour. I like to show off my entire collection. I've been living in two places at once for the past five years, you know, being a college student. So I've been living with half of, no, more like 75% of my collection at home and then 10 to 25% wherever I am currently in. And it's been making it very hard to film that kind of video, but my goal is to do that at some point. So be on the lookout for that uh, September, ideally September or October. Who knows sometime soon that's the full video i really do hope you enjoyed if you like this video please give it a big fat like down below comment down below how you organize your shelves i'm so curious do you like the way i organize my shelves do you need to keep your series together because i know a lot of people who do and for series that have different coloring on the spines it would be broken up and people have a big pet peeve i you know like i said i don't personally care but i do have a lot of series with like just black spines so they stay together or just whatever color things like that. If you like my video and you like my content, please, please, please consider subscribing. It would mean the absolute world to me if you did. I really do hope you choose to stick around, and I will see you in my next video. Bye! Mm -hmm.